Hi everybody, I'm Will and welcome to Adventure Will Skate, the YouTube channel where I document my journey as an almost old guy getting back into skateboarding. If you like what you see, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, share it with your friends, and follow me on Instagram. So today it is raining, but luckily that is the best kind of weather to sit inside and do some video editing. So in today's video, we're gonna watch some clips from my session at the park on Saturday with Finley, Joel, and Casey, some clips from my solo trip on uh, Monday morning, and uh, some clips from my trip to the Kimball Skate Park today. So with that, let's hop back in our little time machine and let's go skate. Good morning, everybody. It is 8 a.m. Saturday, and we are at the skate park. I'm here with my good friends Casey, Joel, and his son Finley, and we're gonna get a nice session in here. I know that when he was a teenager, he skated for quite a while, and um, but he hasn't skated in a long time. And I'm look, I'm watching him ride around right now, and he looks pretty confident. Like third time he's been on the board since he bought it and he's like this close to landing a varial kickflip. Very stoked with that uh, rock and roll and then the fakey rock. I'm finally actually getting that like the balance, the actual rock in the name rock and roll on the, on the coping, which I'm super stoked about. Very good session at the skate park this morning. It was really great to have Joel and Finley come out and to hang out with Casey and skate again with everybody. Um, Brian and Fitz showed up a little bit later, so the park was full of energy and it was awesome. I spend most of the day focusing on my transition tricks. I've got the rock and rolls and rock fakies and uh, fakie rocks almost every single time on that quarter pipe. It's going to be time soon to take those to another one, to one of the more serious quarter pipes. Now I've had the front side disaster in my mind for a while now. I used to be able to do early grab front side disasters on the little quarter pipes at Kimball when I was younger. So I've been thinking about that a lot and today I just started trying it and I almost got a couple. I was so close, but sometimes you just gotta leave a trick at the park. Good morning everybody. You know what time it is. Early. One of the real advantages of coming to the skate park at six in the morning 
is you can leave your stuff right on the ramps, which you shouldn't do when you're at the skate park anyways. But when, you don't, when you're the only person here, it's not a terrible idea to put your stuff in a place that is highly visible and well illuminated. Sky in the morning, sailors take warning. Sure is pretty though, and I'm not a sailor. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Okay, now that was, that's the best way to spend your lunch hour that I can think of. There's a whole bunch of trucks over here setting up for the Harvest Festival. Um, I didn't get that roll in, I'm still terrified of it, but I did get flyouts out of the little section of the Big Bowl, which I'm proud of, and I got some nice lines in, and there was a couple nice dudes at the park ripping it up. So all in all, huge success. So these are the DC manuals, very affordable, very simple skate shoe, canvas top, which is okay for me because I'm not going to do a ton of flip tricks, gum sole, the sole feels really strong, the shoe has a nice amount of flex to it, which is nice because I really like flex in my shoes, and uh, excited to have some new kicks on my feet for the first time since I've taken up skateboarding again, so... So I want to try and get out and skate today, but just now when I was coming back from picking up the shoes, I've noticed that they've, they're going to be closing off a big section of the road that I live on. So, and the guy told me that it's center of the road stuff. So I don't know if I will be able to get out and actually go skating this afternoon, which is a shame because I went to Kimball last night and I did end up filming because I ran into my little cousin there and we just hung out and skated. And um, I didn't go this morning because I thought I'd be going at lunchtime today. But uh, it looks like it might be the end of the day. I'm still going to try to go because I have a new toy, shoes, that I want to play with. And uh, I want to go skate. Hey, everybody. We are at the skate park. It is lunch hour, and I was able to get out of my street, which is under construction. So this is the Kimball Drive Skate Park.
hate to leave another trick at the park, but I did get back. I did get backside 50-50s on the quarter, so I'm okay with leaving that here. I am pooped and I am sweaty. It's time to go home and get back to work. See you soon. Well, everybody, that is gonna be it for the video today. Thank you very much for joining me. The purpose of this channel is to share my passion with skateboarding and hopefully to inspire all of you out there to take it up or try something else that you've wanted to do. Like I said in the last video, our silly dreams are what really make being alive worthwhile. So coming up next week, I'm gonna be traveling to Moncton to skate the Moncton Skate Park as well as the Riverview Indoor Park. I'll be hitting the Garrison Park again this weekend with Joel and Finley, and we'll have lots of fun skateboarding adventures in between as well. I'd like to give a quick shout out to two of our new subscribers, Abstract and Brandon Otilar. Thank you both very much for following the channel. If you do subscribe, leave me a comment below that tells me that you subbed. And to all my other subscribers out there, thank you so much. Your support means so much to me. So everybody, I've been Will. You've been amazing. And until next time, 